Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you the quickest way to grind and to get levels and to grind the Dragoon inside of Shadowvis RPG. There are going to be three main items that you want. This, the Obsidian Skin chest plate. This, um, I'm not sure, I think this is pretty good. I'm not sure if this is necessary though, but I would also use this because I think it, it adds on to the build. Mystic Legs and the Primal Miss Fortune as well as the Firebrand. So I guess that's four, but all these extra things, you could change those out and find something else, but those are just what I'm using because I like health and I also like Armor Shred because Armor Shred is really good and I really like it and really need to use it. I'm going to show you now how to actually get all of those items. So first, I'm going to lure this guy to death. Now they're fall and that guy is kind of glitching out um to get this chest plate right here this is pretty rare you probably heard it in a bunch of other builds but obsidian skin chest plate to get it you can probably imagine you have to kill the guys with the purple chest plate that i'm using right now i'm not sure if you can kill that guy because i've been killing him quite a lot and i could not get it but if you kill this guy right here you should be able to get it if you're lucky because it is pretty rare um, I'm not sure the exact chance, but as you can see, I didn't get it there. It's it's rare. I think like 5% or something like that. The, the Vupa, because that's really good. Like this guy's using it right here. It's pr pretty good for getting this guy because you just stand up here. That's what I did. You can stand here and just laser him. You do have to be a bit of a higher level though. Otherwise, he will catch on to you. But now I'm going to show you how to get the Mystic Legs. Here, right here, if you make it to this area and you are actually rebirth eight not just like rebirth one and you just like went down into the depths and then went through all the portals and everything like that you should be able to get enough money this is really good for mage build but you really only need the mystic legs there might be something better i'm not sure if this is much better but you can kind of like experiment with that but i am using mystic legs because that is what i know best now i am using this shield to get it um, I think you can get it in the shop, but the reason I use it is because all this stuff, it doesn't really give me that much health, and I really need some lifesteal, it's really good, especially since you're kind of AFKing here, and if you die, you die, and you can't, you don't really want to run back, you just got me one spot, and you do get hurt using this strat, but I think that you get that inside of one of the shops, I think it's the shop inside the depths, I'm not 100% sure, I could check it, and I think I actually am going to go check it right now. Alright, yes, I was correct. It is inside of here. I don't know why there's two of them. This one is a little bit better. Um, this is pretty good, I guess. It doesn't really matter, the bonus. You just kind of need it for the lifesteal. But it would be nice to buy the better one, if there is a good one. But I'm doing just fine with my 12 one. And I'm not going to buy this, even though it's pretty cheap. But now, the one thing that you need the most... Primal Misfortune. I actually have no idea where I got this item. I have a couple of them, but if you look here, I got them quite a lot while back. This is the very top, and if I scroll up, 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 it is way up here. So I, it is a pretty rare item, or pretty early game, I guess. I am. Um, I also have it here at the Vile Thorn chest plate. So that makes me think. It could be at the Rebirth 4 area, but it's also here as well. I'm going to have to go explore and try to find it. Oh, I just found out from the Discord server. It is inside the depths. You go into the depths and you fall down. There should be a guy. Wait, let me just check everywhere. Um, yes, I remember, I think, over here, over there. Let me go to every single guy. I think it's that guy right there. Yes, I am correct, I think. Boom, Damos, Guardian of Misfortune. This is him. If you kill this guy, I don't know why I just jumped off. He drops the helmet. I think it might be 100% chance because I just got it. And if you get it, it does not have any bonuses. So there's no point of grinding it multiple times. But this, you have to get this for this OP build. This is a very, very good build. It'll give you so many levels. You have to have this item. There is one more item that is mandatory inside of this build, the Fire Brand. This will make it way better. This is very good. Uh, oops, my bad. 
You need this item. A bunch of magic multipliers, and I think it might be the thing that actually does this. It might just be the normal clicking, and I just killed this guy, and I got his seeking bazooka. But that's that's pretty cool. But to get this actual sword, you have to come over here to this orange area. You go inside the portal, and he is over there. But before we get there, um, I want you guys' opinion. Do you want me to start making videos about different games that aren't Shadow Vest? Because I want to start making different videos, except uh, most of you guys started watching me because of Shadow Vest, so I feel like if I go away from it, you guys won't watch. I need you guys to comment down below and please promise that you'll watch my videos if I do start making other videos. I will still make Shadow Vest, but I'm getting kind of bored of it since I have already made like 10 videos off of it. And there's not really much I can make more videos on. But please comment down below guys and put down some game recommendations that you think I should play that are kind of similar to Shadow Vest. But I'm going to show you. Um, this is not him. This is Lord of the Magma, which is pretty weak if you are pretty good. That's not him either. To actually get the sword, it is over here. You want to go to Kronos. Uh, I'm dying. You want to go to Kronos. And I'm going to kill him just to see if I get a little lucky. Let's see. Let me click. Uh, no, I did not. But he's right up here. He is pretty weak. But his drops are rare. He drops multiple things. He drops like a crimson chest plate, crimson leggings. And he drops a sword. Not sure if he drops a helmet. But if you're here... You could just kill him, you should be able to one-shot him, and he will drop this sword, Fire Brand. It is pretty le rare, I think like 5% or just 0.5%, but with this sword, you have pretty much a complete setup. Other items that I use, these are not mandatory, but I think you should use them. This, Aquarium Charm, it gives you different bonuses, I don't know if that's pretty good. Alright, I finally made it up to actually be able to line it up perfectly. I think you want to go to the second one. Yeah, the second plank. Go a little bit ahead. Tilt yourself a little bit so you can hit both of them. It's nice to zoom out so you can see better and just click. The two cubes go off into their own direction and I think the other guy is not being hit. I think I have to get a little bit closer. It might be more out here. Ah, oh, it's so close. Um, let me think, guys. They might have patched it. Because it did crash. Let me actually check if they updated it. They have updated today. But I'm not sure if they updated this. I really hope they didn't. I hope they didn't move them a little bit. Or just made it so this is not possible. Um, let me see. If I hit... If I fly out... Let me see. Did I hit none? I hit not a single guy. Hmm. They might have actually patched it, guys. I'll keep tinkering around and see if I can get it. Oh guys, I found a new location. Yeah, it looks like the older one doesn't work or it, they patch it or something like that. Um, I'm not sure if you can AFK it. They might have patched it because i not even joking. I started recording and then it crashed. I did like an update thing. And then um, like right away, I joined back and I started recording again. Let's see. If I tilt my body this way, I can hit the other guy. But then I can't hit this guy. I don't know. It's a big dilemma. Oh wait, did I hit them both there? If I do angle it correctly, let me see now. Okay, um, let's see if it gets the guy on the right, because it, it will get the guy on the left. But whatever, if that does not work, because it's not working for me right now, you can still easily grind one of them. All you have to do is just go here, and you can AFK grind, and it does still do insane amounts of damage. As you can see, I do this, he's died, and let's see how many levels I get. I think I get like 2 million levels at 9 rebirth. Um... But all you really have to do is this. And if you do not have this build, just get the Vupa and use the Mystic thing. Just use these and the other, this. And use this thing as well. And if you use this with the Mystical stuff and the, the Vupa and the shield, you could go down. And if you get the correct positioning, you can easily kill that guy. I'm going to go down here and show you. Um, yeah, what, like pretty much what this guy's doing. If you're just here, yeah, literally exactly what this guy's doing. If you go there then you can so easily it's so easy you just automatically kill him but i feel like it's better w with what i'm using it used to be better with what i'm using before like because then you could kill two at once that might still be possible but i'm not sure um but yeah